Well, you know, you don't plan ahead in your life. You, you take it a chapter at a time. Ron Friedley, who was raised in Seattle, Washington and Boise, played multiple sports and instruments at a young age. When he was 13 years old, his parents sent him to a boarding school in Canada. In Canada is where his true athleticism was put to the test, as he was a member of the Brentwood College School rowing team. We won the Canadian High School Championships in 72, and we rowed in the Henley Royal Regatta and finished runner-up in the world. And then uh, in 1976, my uh, teammate went on and rode for Canada in the Olympics in Montreal. By the time he was 18, he had a scuba certificate, pilot's license, and was an international rower. But his drive for sports wasn't finished, as the next stage of his life, he was behind a steering wheel. I raced at Seattle International Raceways and Portland International, California, Sears Point, um, Westwood, Canada. And then I crewed on some teams at Daytona and Sebring. Along the way, Freely has even had to battle a reading disorder, which has given him an extra challenge as an umpire. I was uh, dyslexic, but undiagnosed when I was growing up. The challenge for me is the rule book. Baseball, softball is one of those games that the basics can be explained in two pages, and 95% of what happens is in two pages, but the 5% is on the other 99 pages, and you've got to be prepared. We've got a bat with a possible split in it. You want to have a look see on that? Through it all, Friedley is That's glad it. he's That's become it. an umpire. He's called over 200 games in just 11 months and has lost 25 pounds along the way. We move all the time. In an ideal game, we are invisible, but we're actually moving more than the players. We have to be in the position to make the call.